Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, I have a battle here against a long-time uh, stream viewer, Septimus. I actually claimed to battle him in the past, but I actually made a mistake when I was posting that battle who the opponent was. But uh, this is the battle, well, a battle against Septimus. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Now, uh, if the volume is a little soft on the game, sorry about that. I made a mistake when recording it, and um, I Dinah don't have the battle vid anymore. So, yeah, the uh, game music is going to be a little light in this video. But, uh, what can you do? Anyway, so, Galvantula comes out, and he actually has a really good team. Uh, Galvantula comes out just to, uh, go for the, uh, spider net, which is going to lower my speed. And, uh, I thought he would actually switch. I didn't think he'd want to, like, sack his Galvantula quite yet. But, uh, no, he, uh, stays in, and I just go for the U-turn. So I go out into Miss Magius now, and he's just gonna go for the Thunder Wave, which is not particularly good on Miss Magius. Um, since this mage just kind of relies on its speed, but I do get a sub up, which is all right, and I'm going to try to go for a Calm Mind now. Now, he does have a sound-based move, and in this generation, sound-based moves will bypass, uh, Substitute, so he goes for Bug Buzz, and he does do some damage to me, not a whole lot. I do, I do have the resistance, so he probably would have been better served switching out or something, but, uh, it still does some decent damage, and, uh, now I feel pretty good about taking it now that I have a Calm Mind, so, uh, yeah, that, that's pretty cool for me. And, um, I'm starting to think that maybe I can set up against this guy, but he's probably going to switch. Um, but he doesn't. He ends up going for Thunder. I was thinking he was going to try to switch. I wanted to get damage on whatever he went into. Um, but he does actually fade my substitute as I go for the attacking move to kill it, which is bad because I'm paralyzed and uh, I don't have my sub anymore. So he made a pretty good play just sacrificing his Galvantula, um, because now he can revenge kill me with pretty much any physical guy like uh, Macho Man here, and uh, it's going to force me to switch, because I do not want to lose Miss Magius, even though it is uh, paralyzed. Now, I do go into Azumarill here, because I was uh, figuring... I, I don't even know. I think I was predicting something. But uh, he goes for the knockoff, which I resist. That's probably what I was predicting, actually. And it knocks off my Salakberry. And the reason I have Salakberry is because this is a Belly Drum uh, Azumarill, which I was kind of dying to try out, and, uh, yeah, I go for the, uh, belly, dan or belly drum, so that goes well, and in comes a toga kiss, and I'm just like, okay, I c should be able to kill with Aqua Jet, right? With pure power? Apparently not. This must be a very physically bulky toga kiss. They normally, they're especially bulky, but they must have some, uh, defense investment on this toga kiss, because I really thought that that would be a KO, and, uh, that I would have... A pretty awesome sweep, but apparently not, and uh, my Azumarill just dies. So I go into my Alakazam, which is my Mega. So uh, I Mega Evolve here, and yeah, I'm still slower than this Togekiss, I believe, because of the uh, speed debuff from his uh, thing. No, I actually outspeed it. That's right, because Togekiss is cl uh, slow as crap. So yeah, I do end up killing the Togekiss, so that's pretty cool. Um, but now he's going to go out into Garchomp, which I'm not going to be able to outspeed. This thing is a little faster than Togekiss. And uh, I'm really worried about it, so I decide to switch out. No, I actually stay in, uh, thinking that he would predict me to switch out. And uh, pretty good thing that I did, because he did try to set up a sub, which would have been disastrous for me. So I uh, do break the sub, and now I think I switch out as he attacks, not wanting to risk uh, another sub. Or maybe not, I don't remember. Either way, he's going to attack here. I switch, I think. So I go out to my Miss Magius, kind of as death fodder, at, or hoping that he goes for a uh, Earthquake. But he does go for the Dragon Claw, which is enough to take Miss Magius out. And that's kind of sad, but uh, I guess while paralyzed, it really wasn't going to do much. So this Garchomp is still a major problem for me. So I go into Dragonite. I know he'll outspeed me, but uh, I do have a Marvel Scale or Multi Scale. One of the it's one of those abilities that uh, lowers damage as long as I have uh, full life. So I kind of feel safe going for the Dragon Dance to get my uh, speed boost, so I'm faster. Keep in mind that I am not affected by Sticky Web since I am a Flyer. So, uh, yeah, I have plus one, plus one, and I go for a uh, Dragon Claw against this uh, Macho Man as he goes for a knockoff to knock off my item, so I lose my life orb. Oh, well. And uh, now he goes for the Mach Punch, knowing he's going to die. just wanted to get some extra damage on me before he does as I go for the Dragon Claw to get rid of it. So uh, that's pretty nice. That is pretty nice indeed. And he is going to go out into his uh, Gardevoir, which is his Mega. And uh, once it Mega evolves, it... Uh, sorry about that beeping, by the way. Uh... It will be a fairy, so I can't go for the Dragon Claw. My other attacking move is Fire Punch, which is also resisted. Um, but I just go for it anyway, just figuring why not. Well, no, it doesn't resist. I don't know what I'm thinking. For some reason, I always think because... I don't know. No, no, it's the other way around. Fire resists fairy. I'm, I'm stupid. Either way, the Fire Punch is not enough to take the Gardevoir. He takes... Uh, yeah. He takes me out, which is not good. As I go into Registeel, um, and he has Focus Blast, which 
is not good, but my Registeel does take it like a champ, as I'm able to take out his Mega Gardevoir with Shadow Claw, which, uh, of course, kills it. And that's pretty cool, as I just eat my lefties, nom nom nom. Unfortunately for me, I really have no counter for this Garchomp right now, so things are not looking good. I don't think there's really anything I can do uh, against this. My only two Pokemon is this Registeel and, I think, Alakazam that it's left, so I just have to stay in and just try to get damage on it, but he has a Swords Dance, so he's a Swords Dance Garchomp, which is pretty nasty, especially when he, all my Pokemon uh, have lower speed thanks to his Sticky Web, so uh, yeah, this is basically his game. I can't even do enough damage to break a sub. Kind of taunting at this point, since all he really has to do is, is sweep me at this point, but he does set up the sub, I guess, just to be safe, and uh, yeah, he's just going to kill me with Earthquake, I believe, next turn. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much GG, because I can outspeed him, and obviously Garchomp with a Swords Dance, with a sub, no less, is a pretty good sweeping potential. So that was a very good game, Septimus. Um, and, uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun, and uh, more battles to come. So if you like this, make sure you com uh, rate, comment, and subscribe to this channel for more uh, awesome Wi-Fi battles. And if you want to battle with me, the best way to do so is my Twitch livestream. You can follow me there and uh, be informed whenever I stream. Keep in mind, I do not do Wi-Fi battles every stream, but uh, a good majority of them I do. And So once again, a good game, Septimus, and uh, yeah, hope to battle again soon. Anyway, today's question of the day is, what is your favorite video game or uh, video game release of this year? It's getting nord at the end of the year, and this is actually uh, the release date of Fallout 4 which is a game I'm really looking forward to. Actually, I was playing it a bit uh, earlier, and it might be a glitchy, a glitch fest, but it's uh, pretty damn good so far. So leave a comment about your favorite game release of this year, and uh, yeah, see you again next time, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and that like button. Hit them both. Hit them all. Why not? Later.